I have six minutes left, and I'll babble on for six minutes, and I'll end the video here, and I will take a shower, go get a pack of smokes, upload the video, and I will enjoy the show when I come back home, obviously. And stay tuned tomorrow, I'll be continuing, I'll be finishing off Chapter 6, which is the Old Forest, and in Chapter 7 will be in the house of bon Tom Bombadil. Tom Bombadil is a very interesting character, obviously. So all you Lord of the Rings fans, you got to bear with me here. As I'm trying my best to want to pump out what this series is. I hope you guys are enjoying my series. I know you guys love it when I babble on. Mm -hmm. But I hope you guys are enjoying my Lord of the Rings series read along also. As all you, to all you guys who are not book, book nerds. At least you're getting a gist of the Lord of the Rings story obviously. Which is pretty cool obviously. Right. I told you this book series here. I'm going to keep as treasury. I'm not going to buy another edition of Lord of the Rings. That's just a waste of money. I'm going to keep this Lord of the Rings. Uh, this Lord of the Rings edition as treasury. In my condo, my nice 100 Minaro dot condo, and I'm gonna buy the 4K Blu-ray Lord of the Rings movies and the 4K Blu-ray Hobbit movies. I'm gonna go on a binging spree. I'm gonna keep that as, as a collection, obviously. I'm also gonna get the Matrix trilogy in 4K. I'm gonna get the Matrix trilogy. Matrix is a, is a very amazing franchise, as well as Harry Potter. I never got a chance to see all the Harry Potter movies. I only saw the first five movies. I didn't see the the the, the sixth the sixth one. I didn't see the seventh one. For the two parts of the seven, I didn't see those movies yet. Yes, I'm gonna get the, the whole trilogy, the whole 4K Blu-ray trilogy of all those movies. I'm gonna have a, I'm gonna have a, a small movie collection in my condo, obviously. And every time I watch movies, me and my wife can watch it in our big screen TV. We can watch it in our nice, in our nice what? You might hear some noise upstairs. You might, you might hear some. Um, you might get some. Um, what? I'll either watch it in my private IMAX here or I'll watch it in my nice big flat screen TV in my living room. Listen to top notch. And that's why those actors are lucky because those actors are going to get to see my 100 Moon Knight. I'm going to keep saying this to all you guys who haven't seen Iron Man. A lot of you guys have seen Iron Man. You know how in Iron Man, Tony, Spar Tony Stark is a billionaire. He's a multi-billionaire and he owns this like high-end like fucking house. Well, I'm going to be owning a top high-end Ruta car like that. So picture something like that, except I'm owning a condo on top of the roof, obviously. I'll have my own condo on top of the roof. I can even have my own helicopter in my, in my roof, that condo, if I wanted to. I can have my own helicopter. I don't need a helicopter, though. Me and my wife don't need a helicopter, no. A private jet's more than enough. But I, I can even have my own private helicopter that can land on, my, on top of the roof of my condo. I can do that if I want to, right? But I'm not going to own my own helicopter, no. A private jet's good enough, but to all you guys who have seen Iron Man, you know how Tony Stark owns that high-end, like, fucking top-notch house? Like, high-end house? Me and my wife are going to own a top, high-end condo like that, man. I'm putting $100 million towards it, man. Perhaps even a bit more. I might even put, like, $110 million towards it. A bit, I might go a bit over $100 million. I might go over, I might maybe even put a $110, $115, 120 million towards my condo, which is high, high tech, man. It's not just any condo. It's a condo on, built on top of a roof. So I'm going to find a roof in Vancouver, downtown, for me to build my condo. You're looking at something high, high, high tech, man. A condo built on top of a roof, man. High, high tech condo. Something like Tony Stark and Iron Man. Yeah, man. A top high-end condo like that. Hence, these actors, when they walk into my condo, they're like, holy shit, Ivan, you have a nice crib here. Especially the biggest actors. The people who are really going to be, the people who are really, really going to be wowed are the biggest actors and the rising stars. And the smaller aliasers. Because small aliasers, most of them own like a three, four Minara house, whatever it is. Five Minara house, whatever it is. The bigger aliasers actors are not going to be as well because those guys own like 10, 20, 5, 8 Minara houses. They own really, really nice houses. But even the big AS actors, when they walk into my condo, even they're going to be wowed as you're looking at something unheard of. Most of them don't even have $100 million in the bank. And I'm owning a $100 million roof dot condo on top of the roof. And those actors are going to get to party it up with my $100 million roof dot condo for five hours, man. High high tech high tech high tech elevator high tech garage with a GPS. I'm also gonna have a GPS in my house. High tech living room, high tech terrace, high tech advanced speaker system in my house when I want to listen to music. With my parties, I'm gonna put music on. Get this nice music. The actors get drunk on my condo. I might even do a thing where the actors I'll, I'll buy like cigars and all the actors can smoke a cigar while uh, during the party in the terrace. I'll buy cigars for me, my wife, and all the actors. Everyone smokes a cigar and they get to drink and party up my condo. Yeah, man. Right? You know how in um in Fast and Furious, Fast and Furious 2, when 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 that when that boss 
he had a cigar. He's like, he's like, you made us do all this for a fucking cigar. That guy had a cigar. He was boss. I'm going to have my own. I'm going to smoke my own cigar. And I'm going to have all the members of what? All the actors are all, I'll buy them all a cigar. They can smoke a cigar while they're partying up my condo. Yeah, man. They're going to be partying inside and out of my terrace and inside too, obviously. Top high-end music. Put some top-notch music on. Yeah, man. You're looking at it. Gonna, the actors are going to have a blast. That's why these actors are really, really going to beg their asses off. The Sky Shows is a top notch fucking company. It's burying all these Hollywood companies. As these Hollywood producers, yeah, they have parties at their houses, but they probably own a 5, 8, 10, 20 minute house. Well, I'm owning a 100 minute car on top of the roof. Something like Iron Man in, 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 in Iron Man, like Tony Stark's house in Iron Man. And that's how top much Sky Shows are going to be. Well, stay tuned for my next video, which will be a continuation of my Chapter 6 Relong the Old Force. This is Ivan Omer. I'm signing out. Peace.